<laughs> All right, Naj, it's one of the moments for me. We about to be on our way to NYC on this little modeling photo shoot. About to test it out, I mean, try to see if we like it. Just something to do, you know. Remember this, remember this. It's great things like this don't always happen, you know. How often do you get to say, I went to New York for the modeling, bro? Just remember this. Damn, okay, funny. Shit was blowing my. Okay, so right now, we outside this quick check near me. We stopping to get some gas real quick. Then we finna be on our way. I don't usually go to New York too much, so like, this is the first time I'm gonna be really going to New York on my own, like driving type shit. Everybody, they always tell me, never drive to New York, always take the train, cause like shit could happen, just hella shit with your car. The parking tickets is crazy. You get impounded, all that. It's the one of the biggest cities for me. So like, I'm always taking precaution as necessary, but they did tell me that I have to bring a duffel bag full of different outfits as I was informed by the, um, the agency. So yeah, okay. I guess me and Nini, for me, we gonna have to take a ride over there. She gonna be straight. I'll get back with y'all. Can I get 20 regular? Actually, can you just fill it up, please? Fill it up? Yeah, whatever it takes to fill it up. Thank you. Thank you. All oh, this shit looking. Had to go to a different bar, but let me know. Let me know in the comments below. Is this shit looking clean or not? Let me. Ah, this is my shit, nigga. Hold on. Got what you going through, and I swear that bitch go back. Every time your shit come on, she cut it out. She right. It's only one of me. You cannot touch my right. You just can't. I'm with all my guys, these niggas ain't in our life. Damn. Right. tunnel shit is crazy i'm not gonna lie first time i came here when i seen this shit it was like amazing to me just to think like niggas is really driving underwater right now like that shit is insane just the whole concept i first came here around like christmas time in an uber like, i just wanted to see the fucking rockefeller scented tree these scenes just be fire. I feel like you don't really see this anywhere. I feel like New York is just so popular because of their uniqueness, bro. Like, no other city is doing this shit like this. I'm not gonna lie. Bro, these buildings tall as shit. Like, I always be seeing in the movies, like, I be thinking they exaggerating, but these buildings is really big as fuck. Like, no lie. These just damn near cover the whole sky. I'm looking up, this shit just keep going, like. Nah, this is different. And for regular people here, like, this is just, it's just every day, like, these niggas barely see the sun. They barely get sun on their skin in this bitch. My nigga, is this the Ninja Turtle van? Niggas got Master Splinter up in there, Shredder and shit. I'm not gonna lie, I don't even know how these niggas able to do it. Like, I'd be depressed as fuck not being able to see the sky. These niggas wake up every day, and they look up, and they just covered in buildings bro but i guess it's everybody got a different cup of tea or whatever this shit couldn't be me though Try to look at the view. This is crazy, yo. We are so high up on the 11th floor. And there's buildings that go way taller than this, like, street all the way down there. 
Yeah, let me uh, hang my clothes up on my outfits that I'm finna wear, along with the accessories, the go, the bag, the shoes. These are the people over here that's gonna be helping me. Here's the inside of the studio. And here go the outfit that I'm rocking right now for the first shoot. They're gonna be the rock the white tee and jeans. Of course, it's gonna be no shoes, so no shoes, no socks. And he's gonna have the bare toes. Uh, chill out with me, chill out with me. We're about to get into this shit. They said I come from right there, so. That's what's up. It is what it is. Yeah. Alright, so niggas just finished the photo shoot. What's gonna happen now is an image consultant gonna come out and she's gonna show me my photos more than likely. She's gonna probably put together a portfolio for me that she's gonna wanna make me pay for it. Let me catch y'all when I'm out of here. There we go. It's the Empire State Building right there. I don't even know what niggas doing there. Like, why is that shit so tall, bro? All right, so it's the next day, and as you can see, there wasn't really a lot of footage actually being recorded of the photo shoot. Mainly one, because they wouldn't permit me to, and obviously I can't record myself while having pictures taken of me. And two, because I had no cameraman, so I had my boys that were supposed to go with me, but unfortunately, they bailed on me last second. I had one on this that was supposed to go with me. But, um, yeah, I wish y'all could have seen it because it was a really great experience, you know. We was taking pictures, midday, New York City streets, filming traffic, all of that. As soon as the cars would stop, you'd be like, go, 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 and I'll run out there, hit the pause real quick, and boom, take the picture just like that. What have I learned from this? Number one thing that I learned is that if you're not in a very open-minded individual, this will be a very hard experience for you. You probably end up quitting. Like shit, like little shit, like they having to dabble a little makeup on you and all that shit. Regular people will understand, but there are some closed-minded individuals out there that you know they just wouldn't understand that that type of thing. Hey, but y'all see the camera quality though? This shit looking clean on it. <laughs> <laughs> let me chill, let me chill. Alright, with that being said, that's gonna be all for today's vlog. Hope y'all enjoyed. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, whatever. How all that shit go. I don't know. I'm new to this YouTube shit. Yeah. And get back with me in the next one. Y'all boys be safe. I'm out. <laughs>